Hey guys, how's it going? My name is SNK Ozzy, welcome back and in today's video I'm going to be talking to you about Neverwinter with the brand new update with the rise of Tiamat or Tiamat. Anyway, as you can see in the corner there it says 8 days and 23 hours and a few things to talk about in the updates and the patch notes that they've been releasing um, I don't know whether you can see in the bottom right hand corner at the minute yeah it pops up just straight up there is the mini map now they've added this in I mean I've been waiting for it for a long time it is very irritating when you can't see where you're going sometimes the little crystal meth road path thing doesn't pop up and you can't really see where you're going anyway that now fades out when you're being attacked or you're fighting and you can see where you're going finally unfortunately it's not one of those where it follows the face of direction it's a generalized static map and you spin around in it um, so it's a little bit confusing to get your head around if you're used to more of the like GTA style ones or Assassin's Creed or Call of Duty um, there are a few other things that they've added in which I can show you which will pop up later uh, to do with the PvP stats so you now have a rating in it along with um, your match history as well so you can see from the last I think it might, it's between 20 and 30 games you last played in you can see whether you won them, whether you lost them, how many kills you got, assists, deaths and your overall score in the game so obviously if you uh, run a certain class you can now decide which is better which you think obviously if you're getting a lot of assists then you're doing quite a bit of damage things like that um, they've added a few other things they've also added now the nine hell wells or the dragon wells map um, I haven't got any of that footage to show you yet I might do that for you guys if you like this um, then yeah that will probably pop up but that area at the minute is very encounter based like you'll be running around the map is absolutely huge on that one as well um, you'll be running around and suddenly something will pop up out of nowhere um, most of the time you're on your own and there's not that many people around when you're doing encounters they're all at the beginning at the minute because people obviously haven't picked up the game it's still the first day that the update's been out um, so people are still a bit behind a little bit so yeah they've got to jump into it do a few of the overall missions that pop up and whatever um, but the encounters now they've changed some of the smaller encounters that they have are two to three people so you don't have to do like the huge dragons they still are those big dragons in there um, they've also added new things to the dragon horde um, seller so you can get more equipment um, things like those golden uh, artifact weapons that you have they've also as you can see now they've added a new lockbox which is the dragon forged lockbox where you have a chance to be a different race which is the metallic uh, dragonborn ancestral dragonborn so it's a re-roll again uh, the gorgon which is the mount in this lockbox as well as the golem which i think looks absolutely amazing i didn't actually check whether it says defense slots so i guess he's going to be a, a big defensive player for you guys so i mean if you're very highly into attack but you need someone to take some of the damage so like the hunter rangers um or people who are focused in a lot on crit strike or power with any other classes then that was great now this is the pvp stats that i was talking to you guys so that's the overall it will tell you a big sub base the minute i haven't played any games i've tried to get into domination and it's just not working for me i don't know why it just isn't um i think it might be to do with the patches and that's the match history for you guys and the standing doesn't work either anyway guys if you enjoyed the video hit that like button down below and subscribe for more like this thank you so much for watching